We call them fireworks, but in reality, they're explosive devices and they come with an inherent danger. As WMAR 2 News' Jeff Hager reports, that danger was on full display at the James N. Roby Public Safety Center in Howard County. With their colorful packaging and the promise of a dazzling light show, Acting Maryland State Fire Marshal Jason Mowbray understands the attraction. Fireworks are very enticing. They're, they're exciting, they're, they're loud. But they can also be dangerous, whether it's a sparkler igniting some clothing or a powerful firework exploding in your hand. So we're looking at, uh, you know, they'd wrap the fingers around uh, that M80 before they set it off. And, and this is quite typical of what we see in real life that, uh, um, uh, you know, this is an explosion. So it's a lot of force and it can certainly blow fingers off as you're seeing here. Last year here in Maryland, there were more than 200 injuries suffered due to fireworks, some involving the eyes, others, the hands, the feet, and the fingers. As an ER nurse, one of the most devastating things for me to hear when a parent brings a child in or is, is brought in is, wow, I, I turned away for a second, two seconds. Um, so the guilt that's there and that you'll never be able to take that back. And in at least two cases in Southern Maryland last year, the mistakes proved to be deadly. They had uh, held them too close to their, their body and there was a malfunction of the firework and it created a lot of traumatic injury uh, to their person and they, they you know, subsequently died from those injuries. Experts encourage parents to learn which fireworks are legal here in Maryland and which are not, to make sure only adults light them and better yet to attend community fireworks shows manned by professionals as a safe alternative to setting off their own. In Howard County, Jeff Hager, WMAR 2 News.